Mester and welcome to Mendens. Mendens are nutritious, delicious meals that you can make in minutes using five ingredients or less. Let's get started with today's Minden. Today we are going to make a cauliflower Reuben sandwich. And not reinventing the wheel here, I'm just trying to come up with different dinner ideas that maybe you would not have thought of putting together, especially you wouldn't have thought of putting these items together. But I did, it's delicious and I'm sharing it with you. First thing we're going to do is we are heating up our fry pan and I am spraying it with a little bit of olive oil spray and you can get this at um, uh, Trader Joe's and you probably already have it because we're using it every week. And this is our first ingredient, these cauliflower patties. I already defrosted them. They come in the frozen, free frozen freezer section at Trader Joe's and I just defrost them in my refrigerator when I know I want to use them. Six come in a package and they say a serving is two, so there's three servings in here, but what we're doing is we're making a whole meal out of this, and we're going to say that a serving is, um, the nutritional information will be per cauliflower patty. So if you are familiar with the traditional Reuben sandwich, you take um, corned beef and sauerkraut and a Russian dressing, and it's on a rye bread and grill it. Well, this is gonna be Instead of bread, we're using these cauliflower patties. Then what I did was, I took this peppered turkey and I just sliced it up into chunks. And we're just gonna lay it right on top. And this is really good. I already made it, I already ate it. And I will admit, I couldn't eat just one. And we're gonna take some sauerkraut. I got this pickled sauerkraut at Trader Joe's also. If you don't have a Trader Joe's near you, you can find very similar ingredients at a grocery store that you enjoy shopping at. I just love Trader Joe's because it's easy, it's convenient, I love the pricing. They don't sponsor me, I, um, I just have to enjoy shopping there. Alright, now, instead of a Russian dressing, we're using this jalapeno sauce and it's about 8 tablespoons. It's, I never measure anything, I'm a little of this and a little of that, but I know that this will be about 8. There we go. And then we're going to top it off. I'm topping it off with this artificial cheese because I know this brand melts real well. If you don't mind mixing milk and meat, go ahead and use a cheese of your choice. Pepper Jack mozzarella, they both work great. Uh, this will literally taste just like you're using mozzarella and it will also melt just as good. There you have it. Every week we bring you a new recipe on Monday to cook along with me. The whole premise is that you turn on YouTube and we cook together on Monday. I post the shopping list every Saturday on our website, which is www.mindens.com. If you follow us on Instagram, we'll also show you finished pictures of the product and give you a little sneak peek on Sunday of what we're gonna cook together on Monday. Each week it's different. I never know what we're gonna cook, so stay tuned each week. Subscribe to our channel. It's free, tell your friends. And thank you for joining us once again. Watch our Instagram so you can see a picture of this finished product. It will be delicious.